Morning, this is Chad with Total Value RV here in Elkhart, Indiana. Uh, here to do a walk around for you on a brand new 2016 Thor Axis model number 25.2. Here in Axis Row here today. So you can see we we're loaded up with plenty of 2016 Axises, all different models, but today we're going to focus on the brand new 25.2 model. Um, this particular model is going to have a rear bedroom slide talk about that a little bit more. I want to show you some, some neat features here. Number one, um, the huge windshield. If you come around here, you look at the aerodynamics, okay, that this provides. Aerodynamics is a big deal with these lower profile units because the more aerodynamic they are, the better they're going to handle on the road. Um, this being on a 12,500 pound chassis, uh, the aerodynamics are play an important role. Uh, you look at the low front wind skirting here, okay, it's a lower profile unit. That means you're going to have, once again, better aerodynamics. If you look here, you're going to have a tapered front end look. Okay, your front end actually tapers, once again, to provide better aerodynamics. This coach also, because it's built on a 12,500 pound chassis, uh, it's going to boast independent front suspension. Okay, that really helps with the ride and the handling of this motorhome. The independent front suspension is exclusive to uh, this chassis. Uh, the next chance you're going to get a chance to get one of those is if you step up to the $420,000 Tuscany motorhome. That also has independent front suspension. Come back to the axis, you have, once again, the chrome heated exterior mirrors uh, with adjustable feature from the inside. That has an integrated camera system, which is blinker activated, by the way. Okay, that's going to pick up anything that the naked eye wouldn't, uh, especially at nighttime. This particular HD Max exterior is called Windjammer. Okay, that's a brand new color for our 2016s. Um, we're going to point out a couple of features that have been changed for the 2016 models. One of them, obviously, is the new exterior colors. The other is going to be the Bluetooth exterior speakers and Bluetooth radio inside. Okay. Did you notice this awning here? We've got some wind today. Okay. But with this awning here, it's going to adjust a little bit as the wind kind of kicks. Um, Obviously, if it gets too extreme, you run that awning in, but you can actually adjust your pitch right here, okay? That'll adjust the angle of the awning so that when the sun starts to set on your campsite, um, you're able to shield yourself a little bit better from that. Radius entry door with a frameless window up front just looks really good. Um, don't want to miss the fact that Thor does a great job with their frameless window, even in the front cockpit area. As you can see, there's no gasket or seal to mess with over time. Okay, and just has a really nice look to it. Frameless windows all the way around. Those open from a top swinging hinge here and allow for great ventilation uh, from an engineering standpoint. When you crank those 12 volt attic fans, it circulates air much, much better than your traditional windows. Um, on top of that, it allows you the ability to open up the bottom, okay? Let the, even if your awning's in, let the rain run right off the top of the window and off the bottom of the window without entering the coach, okay? Provided you don't have a, an extreme wind. Uh, of course, this is, is going to have the 32-inch exterior television. Uh, this particular model has 32-inch TVs all the way throughout. Uh, the bedroom TV is an option, uh, but the front TV is also a 32-inch. The outside TV, once again, 32-inch. Uh, you're going to have speakers uh, on the outside, which are, once again, Bluetooth speakers. Those are Jensen, by the way. But looking here, you have lit rotocast line compartments, okay? Flush mount baggage doors. Once again, rotocast line compartments. And something new here you can come on down. GFCI protected outlets, HDMI plug-in. And then you have your inserts here for audio and video, once again with the lit compartment. Uh, that just makes your entertainment that much more fun. If you want to set up a video gaming console or anything like that, you can do that outside. <clears throat> um, of course, just your, your basic uh, reefer vent, furnace uh, ducting here, uh, your vent for your microwave, nothing fancy there, but um, just see everything kind of blends really nicely with the coach. 16-inch Michelin tires all the way around with stainless steel wheel liners, folks. Making your way back here. Get a chance to see some additional cargo. 
This one, as well as your front cargo, are full pass-through cargo areas, okay? Allowing for larger items. Here's your back bedroom slide, okay? Of course, you have the LED backup lighting system and your backup cameras. Come around here to the slide out. I'm gonna show you something with these Trentex slides. This is all aircraft aluminum here. All right, very strong, very durable. Um, this makes for a great slide mechanism. Of course, we vacuum bond and laminate our slide walls all the way around as well. Okay, you have a 8,000 pound hitch, which you don't want to pass up back here. That's a big deal. Uh, the 8,000 pound hitch, so um, this is a 6.8 liter Triton V10, two valve motor. Um, so you're gonna have the ability to tow a nice sized vehicle behind you. And of course, this coach dry is gonna weigh just under 10,000 pounds. Okay, making your cargo carrying capacity that much uh, more. You notice where the exhaust uh, is for the generator. Bend it out the proper, proper way, not towards your camp, not under a slide out or anything like that. Also, you have a, a Cummins Onan RV Quiet Gas Generator. That's a four kilowatt generator. Um, perfectly efficient for this coach. And um, what's nice about that is that runs under 70 decibels and uh, the beauty of that is, although it's positioned back here by the bedroom, you'd never know it. It wouldn't hinder you from taking a nice afternoon nap. 55 gallon fuel tank with this coach, okay? Uh, 55 gallons is gonna get you a long ways, uh, especially with the fuel economy that you're gonna pick up with this gas coach. Uh, fuel economy is just gonna depend on the driver, but um, definitely well over 10 miles per gallon. Um, so that's always nice. Access here, uh, of course you have hot and cold, water here at your exterior shower, but I'll open that up so you can see that. For those of you at home that have never seen that before. So if you're out there, you know, by the beach, uh, by the lake somewhere, you don't want to come in with sandy feet and things like that, that's what that's for. Another great feature is if you have a spill down here in your um, dump area, uh, you're able to easily clean that up. Here's your dump station here. City water connection and gravity fill. Okay, you've got a, a handy backflow uh, system here, so it um, makes filling up your freshwater tank pretty easy. This is gonna be your propane tank. Okay, you have a 12.2 gallon capacity with this tank. Um, easy to re-gauge on the outside and quick shutoff capability. Easy to fill, easy to access. Here's one end, I'm gonna get out of the way of the camera right here. Here's one end of your pass-through storage. Turn that light on there. It's pretty neat. All right, so, seeing the outside, one thing I did forget to mention, your fog lights down low and your LED lighting strip up here under your headlights. Um, really quick, just wanna wanna pop the hood on this guy here. So, come on back and take a look. Everything's rather accessible. Anything that you need to get in here for, uh, whether it be checking your engine oil, filling your engine oil, um, accessing your battery. It's all pretty accessible here. One of the changes that was made to these later models um, for the 2016s um, was an easier access for your engine oil fill. Um, we've extended the neck of that line to make it that much more accessible, so um, no more use for a long funnel or anything like that. And uh, that's one of the nice things nice things about this manufacturer is they're going to continue um, uh, building a, a product until it's perfect. And uh, this one here has had a couple of years uh, to perfect itself or to work out any of the bugs. And these new 2016s are just on point. Let me show you something, show you the inside here. Copper shimmer interior, okay. Olympic cherry wood.
okay? 32 inch television on the inside, but take a look here. I mean, for a 25 foot Class A motorhome, you've just got an exceptional amount of room. Great, so some of the neat things are the residential uh, style features that you're gonna get. Aside from just having a deep uh, full sink here, residential style faucet uh, with a pull out sprayer, extendable countertop space avail available on this option. Um, you have some nice comforts. Number one, you're positioned directly across from the, the television. Okay, so no more, like a lot of the smaller uh, motorhomes, you're gonna turn your neck and watch TV, you know, just because of the size and the design. This one here, you're positioned right across from the TV. Makes sense. All of your chairs swivel around up front. Both of your captain's chairs, I should say. Swivel around and, uh, and join the party. You have a nice table that sets up between those two chairs. Pull-out laptop station up front. Oh, I don't want to pass that up, but pull-out laptop station up front, okay? You say, well, Chad, how's that pull-up? I'll show you. Right there. It's as simple as that, okay? Mills on the go, you know, reading a book, whatever you may need. Uh, it's, it's there for you. It's kind of nice. Cup holders everywhere in this coach. Um, of course, you have a nightshade, which will give you full privacy at night. Wrap around curtains for additional privacy. Of course, this will double as double as a sun visor. But uh, emergency start switch. Of course, your fog light switch. Uh, your new your new dual mirror Axera TV or um, sorry touchscreen system up front. This is where you're going to be able to see your blinker activated cameras, um, your side view mirrors, backup camera, and all of that, um, as well as have. Uh, Bluetooth capability so you can literally pull up from your smartphone um, Google Maps and you have your GPS navigation from your smartphone uh, mirror right onto the screen it's kind of a nice feature to have um, talking a little bit more about this uh, this cockpit area up front um, I did mention uh, you have the 6.8 liter Triton V10 the two valve motor um, 420 uh, pounds per foot of torque with that, that there so um, it's a five-speed uh, transmission with overdrive, and it's going to have a tow haul feature built in at the end of the shifter there. Um, that's going to help uh, anytime you're making a downgrade, towing a vehicle, um, just an added assurance to take some of the stress off the brakes. Um, heated mirrors, which I mentioned outside, which are uh, controllable from the inside of the coach. Something kind of special with our our motorhomes, guys, and I'm just gonna while we're up here in the co cockpit, I'm gonna I'm gonna flash this here because we're proud of this. 47.9 miles. That's not 479. That's 47.9. And you say, well, Chad, why is that special? Well, number one, you don't have any other anybody else breaking this coach in improperly, um, towing a travel trailer behind it, or towing a vehicle behind it to get it to another dealership. Um, you get to pick this motorhome up, put the fresh mileage on it yourself, and um, break it in the way that you would break in any of your uh, vehicles. And that's a big deal. A lot of times we hear, well, you know, Chad, Motor Do What said we could buy it for this. And I say, you know, that's great, but Motor Do What's don't have this, folks. They can't guarantee that, and uh, that's a big deal. So definitely something to consider. Also, we're a factory direct dealer, so we uh, have access to parts. On hand if we don't have something in stock we're five minutes from having it in hand um, our customers no matter where they're at in the United States or Canada we can overnight those parts to them so they have the added assurance that we have that supportive network as far as service goes <clears throat> back to the coach looking up front here guys here's your central command center okay so you can you can run your slide in and out which we'll show you in just a bit uh, you have tank heaters both black and gray uh, for cold weather camping you have your water pump switch and you have your gas electric hot water heater. Okay, gas electric or both. Start your generator from inside if you wanted to. Um, check your LP, batteries fresh, gray, and black tanks. A couple things to point out with this, this coach here is just the abundance of storage. And uh, such a smaller motorhome, uh, you have more storage than, than you're gonna find in a lot of motorhomes. All the overhead cabinet space here.
okay? You have the undermount speakers. Flush mount LED lighting throughout. That's new for the 2016s as well. Something else we've done for 2016 folks is, let me show you this here. I'm gonna drop down the bed and show you the new mattress. Okay, we've gone away from an air mattress, just making it that much easier. That much easier to sleep additional people. Okay. Cotton cloud mattress. We've done away with the air mattress and we've given you this four inch thick cotton cloud mattress. It's um, extremely comfortable, but even more so convenient. Um, this is gonna have a 500 pound weight limit. So you can literally sit two full grown adults up here, no problem. It's definitely long enough, wide enough, and uh, you've got the cargo netting up there as well, so it's safe for children. Uh, we, we give you a ladder to make it easier getting up and down. You don't have to climb on the uh, beautiful furniture to do that. For those of you folks that don't necessarily have the need for extra sleeping, this doubles as interior cargo um, storage area or anything like that. So instead of getting up, going downstairs to the basement area, getting stuff that you may need, you've got that accessible right here. It's just something to consider. It's a standard feature, by the way. Uh, the beauty of the standard features is, um, you know, you're not going to get dinged for them whether you use them or not uh, when you go to trade this, this vehicle in. There's only a couple of options available with the coach. The higher uh, base value, the higher trade in value, you know, when, uh, when that time comes, whether it's 5, 10, 15 years from now. Uh, making our way to the back here. We're going to show you the convection microwave oven. Okay. And this is an option. As opposed to, uh, as opposed to having an oven down here, you get all this extra drawer space down low. Okay. Couples with the beautiful pull-out pantry. Full extension drawers. Nice heavy duty uh, stopping mechanisms in there, catches to uh, prevent it from flying open. We know that's historically been a problem with RVs, um, but that's not a problem in this coach. This bed here flips down and obviously makes sleeping for two more. Um, you have to remove the table with this uh, with this particular floor plan in order to make the bed, but um, it's easy to do. You simply pop the top off, remove the two legs, and um, it should take you less than a minute to get ready for bed. Have a really nice uh, nice setup here. All-in-one bathroom, huge shower, okay? You've got the shower curtain for privacy, and you also have a ceramic commode. Stainless steel sink, tons of functional cabinet space, 12 volt attic fans, functional medicine cabinet, that's a corner cabinet, so you've got some deep space there. Cubby space in here. Good deal. Alright, and new to the 2016s is the French door, okay? Very simple, very effective, um, but looks sleek. Norcold refrigerator, okay? You have the auto capability here. Right now we've got it set to off. You can run it just off of LP if you wish. Um, with the adjustable controls from the outside. Kind of one of the nice features of a Norcold system. Let the cameraman come back here. Show you the wardrobe. So plenty of hanging space. That's a really deep closet if you can't tell by the video. Once again, full extension drawers, residential depth on these drawers. Okay. All full extension. Once again, for privacy, the bedroom has a French door. As you can tell, you got plenty of space, uh, plenty of light in here, okay. 
because of all the windows. You have that nice rear window, two huge panoramic windows here. Once again, they're all frameless, so they're the Jealousy style windows. They're going to open from the bottom. If you've got a, you know, if you've got a pet that's going to stay in the coach, you want to run the, the attic fans and circulate air in the coach, keep your windows open. You don't have to worry about the rain coming wet in the coach. The comfortability of this mattress is, is unparalleled, though. This is really, really a sweet setup here. No need to change your mattress. I know a lot of people, it's the first thing they do when they buy an RV, um, especially when they're trying to cut the cost and find something at a, at a sweet price point. Um, this manufacturer doesn't cut corners. They're going to give you the best of the best. Map lights or reading lights, I should say, above the bed. Um, radio back here with built-in charging station. Cubby holes on either end with receptacles built in in case you have a CPAP machine or anything like that that you may need to plug in. Cell phones, uh, laptops, anything of that nature. All right. Ducted roof air conditioning. Um, of course, a standard feature. This is one of the options, is the big 32-inch TV in the bedroom. Um, but that's also new to the 2016s. I want to correct myself here. Sliding pocket doors versus um, the French-style door in this model. And that's for the bathroom and the bedroom here. Um, a couple of different access models have also redesigned that, that bathroom door, um, giving you a French style door, which we'll show you on another video. Well guys, that pretty much does it for our tour. We want to thank you for coming out and spending some time with us, uh, going over the brand new 2016 Axis product, 25.2 um, model. Once again, Remember, we're factory direct. We're right down the street from where they build these. We're five miles away, literally. So if, in fact, you want to jump into one of these um, before Mrs. Mrs. Jones down the road jumps into one of these, keep in mind, uh, this is one of the fastest um, rising products in our industry um, as far as growth goes. And it's actually cut Class C sales uh, by, by a substantial number. Um, and I think it's this is part of a direct influence um, based on this RUV. But give us a call, guys. Area code 574-262-4460. Ask for Chad. Ask for Jeff, the cameraman. Uh, we'd be happy to help you. Um, once again, we're factory direct. So if you want to take advantage of that, save some money, give us a call. Thanks for tuning in.